Hi, this is Dr. Tara Riddick from Gulf Coast Equine Hospital. I just wanted to show you guys how we actually put a foot bandage on horses. Um, this is something that you'll do sometimes for horses with a hoof abscess. It's probably the most common reason that we put foot bandages on horses. Um, sometimes if they end up getting a crack in their foot, break some of the hoof wall away, um, you know, if they pull that shoe um, and take a little foot with it, it's another reason that we'll have you put a foot bandage on your horse just to give it a little bit of protection. So let me show you some of the parts that we'll use. Um, depending on um, what we're seeing with your horse's foot, what we think will be needed, sometimes we'll have you use a little bit of combine, which is this right here. Um, that's usually for something a little more severe. Um, that's usually what we'll put on your horse, uh, but then we may ask you after we've done our first wrap to use a baby diaper, okay? That can be a really easy way to get a foot bandage on your horse, because uh, you can actually use the nice um, tabs there up around their coronary band to hold that in place while you're getting ready to go to your next step, okay? Then you're gonna follow that with your vet wrap. And then in another video, we showed you guys how to make a duct tape boot, and that's gonna go on the bottom of the bandage, okay? So uh, we're gonna go ahead and wrap up this horse's foot right now. First thing you wanna do, um, even if you've had a foot bandage on your horse, is make sure that the bottom of their foot is nice and clean, okay? And so, we don't want to uh, trap a bunch of dirt in there if they manage to walk through the bottom of their bandage uh, and got a little bit of their shavings or a little bit of mud or something into that bandage. You want to clean up the bottom of that foot. And so this one's pretty clean, but just go ahead and make sure that that stays clean so you're not trapping anything extra in there with a hoof abscess or, um, you know, or a wound. Um, and then we'll tell you when we see your horse what we want you to actually use to treat whatever we may have going on with that foot, okay? So you're going to put your combine or your baby diaper on that foot. We try to make sure we have the heel bulbs covered. Kind of depends on how big that horse's foot is. And then you're going to wrap your vet wrap over whatever we're using as cotton, so your combine or your baby diaper. And I'm not putting this on tight. I just want to make that combine or baby diaper kind of match the horse's foot shape. Because if you rely on just baby diaper to sit on that foot, they're going to sling it off like a sock, and that's not going to help anybody. I do bring my vet wrap up to the level of the pastern, but again, it's not, it's not tight, okay? And if you're having to wrap a foot for a long time, you may choose to not use your whole roll of vet wrap. We typically do go ahead and use the whole roll. Just gives you a couple little extra layers to make everything stay in place. Again, nothing's on here tight. Okay, and then with that duct tape square, we're going to place that right on the bottom of that bandage and then fold the sides up. So remember we cut those corners in to make this part a little bit easier. And if the horse gets antsy, if you've got at least some of it attached, you can let them put their foot down and finish just folding up those sides. Now remember, anytime we have you do a foot bandage, we may alter things for the specific case that your horse has. So whatever happens to be going on with that foot, we may change some things up. Um, and so just keep that in mind. But this gives you an idea of just a very basic foot bandage. It's a nice thing to know how to do. Thanks.